we're asked to find the limit of sine of 3x over sine of 2x as x approaches 0 solution. So there is another limit that we will use in this problem. Um, if you look at the limit as x approaches 0 of sine x over x, that's equal to 1. So this is what we are going to uh, use in this problem. Okay, so let's rewrite our limit carefully. So this is the limit as x approaches 0. In the numerator, up here, we have sine 3x. What we really want, though, is sine 3x over, well, we want a 3x here. Why? Because we, we want these to be the same. So we can use this formula. See here, you have x, x. Here we have 3x, 3x. Now, when we do that, we have to get rid of this 3x. We can't just put it there, so we have to fix it. So 3x. Likewise, on the bottom, we have sine 2x. But what we really want is sine 2x over 2x. So you just put it there. But now you have to fix it. So it's this idea of, of writing down what you want and then fixing it later, right? Everything here cancels. We get the same thing we started with. All right, so at this point, um, looks like the x's cancel. So we get the 3 halves times the limit as x approaches 0 of sine 3x over 3x divided by sine 2x over 2x. And this limit here in the numerator, this is 1. This limit here in the denominator, this is 1. So we get 3 halves times 1 over 1, which is just 3 halves. And that's it. Now, there's ways to show more work. You can actually make a substitution here, uh, and you can make one here, but I, I honestly think that's good enough.